So here's Tanya. I just gave her a little rosebud a short while ago. So now she's playing with it. On the slide. She's like a little botanist. There's George doing the swinging. George and Tanya involved in their autistic pursuits. Lick it a bit, that's it. Lick the insects out of it. And here, with extremely pale skin, pale face. No, you don't. I'm carnivores. Where? Oh well, there we are. There's my wife. Hi. Now, of course, she's decided to take something from the gooseberry. That gooseberry will never have any gooseberries on it because you take all the leaves, and the leaves are necessary to make the sugar. See? As soon as there's any leaves comes up, she rips them off. That's why there's all these little leaves all over it, because the big leaves she already took. And how I expect to get gooseberries... <sighs> there's only one way I'd ever be a gooseberry grower, and that's if I had a whole load of gooseberries, and then she'd never manage to keep up with them as they grew their leaves. She wouldn't be able to rip them off a hundred gooseberry bushes. Here's somebody's planted toast, and I hope that it will grow into a toast tree. There's a hydrangea that's just been planted. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. So pick it up. Feed the birds. Toppins the bag. This is the new leaves coming up on the on the bogwood. It means now there's something to actually. Uh, Something to actually photograph. Now she's taking more roses. That's the problem, you give her one and she takes a lot. 